are tracking a fairly normal summertime day. Our highs will be about 91. A few pop up storms this afternoon. The chances for rain are higher in the Terrebonne Lafourche, Lower Jefferson and Lower Plaquemines Parish. In other words, near the coast, we've got higher chances for rain today. Same story for the next couple of days. Not a whole lot of active weather through Saturday, but looky here Sunday and Monday. I still got higher rain chances, especially by next Monday as tropical moisture builds into the Gulf of Mexico. This has nothing to do with Invest 90. Invest 90 is producing heavy flooding rain over Florida, specifically central and southern Florida, and it's moving away from us. This is going to be in the Atlantic pretty soon. 20% chance of development as it gets out there of becoming a depression that will even miss the East Coast. So once it gets past Florida, no big issues. The next couple of days through about Saturday, rain is concentrated down here over Florida. But let's fast forward into next week, early next week specifically. You can see that heavy rain transitioning to the western and northern Gulf. So we will have a chance for some higher rain totals going into early next week as a surge of tropical moisture comes in from the Caribbean. So right now, here's how I think next week will play out. This surge of tropical moisture will be in the central and western Gulf. In green here is where you have a higher chance of seeing rain from the tropical moisture, including our area back through eastern uh, western Louisiana and into Texas. Now looking at the latest data, it looks like the higher rain totals could be west of us, which means we may avoid the worst flooding. That's great news, but every now and then some tropical downpours that'll start late Sunday and going into uh, Monday. It looks like if you're going to the panhandle next week of Florida, not as stormy, so that's good for those plans. But this yellow zone is where I do see a chance of actual tropical development. We're talking maybe a depression or a named storm forms. This is going to be into the middle and end of next week down here in the southwestern Gulf. And looking at the steering currents right now, if anything does develop down there, our ridge is going to restrengthen by around Tuesday and Wednesday of next week, which means that feature would be pushed west. So if something does form down here, it would probably go into Mexico. There's going to be certainly moisture and rain on the north side of this feature, but this would just be rain up here. But that's where you could actually have some tropical impacts from like winds and things. So still to be seen how much that would develop, but we are seeing some signals that that could form later by the middle and end of next week. So a long time to keep an eye on that. We're going to be hot and mostly dry through Saturday in the 90s. We'll be watching for that tropical moisture into early next week. We say in the highest flood risk right now to our west, but we'll keep an eye on it. Our marine forecast winds are light northeast 5 to 10 knots all the way through Friday. Rain chances are mainly along the Gulf and into the uh, Gulf of Mexico. High tides going to happen this afternoon and your low tides happening this morning.